today I'm going to be sharing with you guys what I put in my toddler and myself beach bag. Um, tomorrow, Halo, myself, my oldest daughter, my sister, and my niece are going to a water park. So I said, hey, this is the perfect time for me to get out what's in my beach bag video. I love doing these type of videos. Um, I love watching other people's videos as what do they have in their beach bag. I just feel like I'm going with them whenever they're going. <laughs> so um, this is going to be either for um, a water park, which that's where we're going tomorrow pool um, a public pool or the actual beach so if you're interested in seeing this video you know the drill continue watching okay you guys so this is miss halo's beach bag isn't it so cute with the little ice creams on it little popsicles perfect for the beach summertime spring all that good stuff i got this beach bag from target's dollar spot i believe it was three dollars three or five dollars um give or take whichever one it is i know it's no more than five dollars uh, but i love this cute little beach bag perfect you know size for her i mean just the right amount of size for her but of course i will carry it i like that it has this little beaded uh i mean not beaded but a little uh rope shoulder strap and it's pretty um durable so Hopefully, we'll be able to have this for years to come. Like I said, you can find us at Target's Dollar Spot. They currently have them out right now, you know, in the Target Dollar Spot. So, you will be able to find it at your local Target. So, let me share with you what I got in Miss Halo's Beach Bag. So, the first thing I'm going to pull out is her little sunglasses. I also got these from Target's Dollar Spot. They are super, super cute. I put it in her Easter basket. I got this pink pair and this black pair. So, um, and it has like gold detailing on it. Super cute. I mean, I would like something like this for me. This does has the UVB protection on it for the, your little ones, their eyes. If you decide, and this was a dollar, if you decide to get those type of glasses, which I would recommend them because we know toddlers can either break them or lose them. So, paying a dollar you're not wasting any money but if you find these at target and as well as dollar tree um be sure to get the ones that have the ubv protection on them um, i know we all like the cute little glasses but make sure you protect the eyes at the same time so you get that way you get more bang for your buck that was something that i had to learn um i did get her some sunglasses like previous year and it didn't have the UVB protection on it so just FYI look for it with the little seal that has that on it so this is her first little thing the next thing I'm going to pull out is her beach towel I actually just got this beach towel and it matches her bag you guys I thought it was super cute when I got her bag they did not have this towel so I seen it and I picked it up just the other day so i thought it was super super cute um it actually matches her wet bag which i'm going to show you guys in a minute and it says super chill on there how cute is that so and it's really really long um i can actually use this but perfect you know for her as well get soaked up with the water um the next thing i have in here is of course a pair of change of clothes um, depending on where you add and how long you're going to stay, um, either you have long pants or whatever, but for Halo, I just got these, um, shorts in here and this is just a regular outfit that she used throughout the week, play clothes. So yes, so I got that and this little shirt that says love on it. Her grandma bought her this when she was one turning two so we had this for a long time and she's barely now fitting in it and it's a um 4t so yeah the next thing i want to share with you guys um is her beach hat her little sun hat um i got this a long time ago at target at target i don't remember the price you guys it's been a while um actually i think it might be a little bit too small with me looking at it i have this for a long time so it's a cute little beach hat sun hat rather um it has like little polka dots as you guys can see on the brim of it and then at the back it has this cute little bow how stinking cute is that um i got this i think she'll be able to fit it if her hair is not up 
and I do believe I'm gonna have her hair up because I just don't want her hair getting all in the way so we'll see but this is in her beach bag she does have another hat that I can just throw in the bag too if that one is too small before we go um, next thing I have here is her wet bag and like I was telling you guys this actually matches her beach towel so I picked this up at Target's dollar spot and this was for sure three dollars and look at the little zipper this gets me I like this this is just I'm so very detailed you guys but look at that how cute is that it's so stinking cute um, it does have a little handle on there and of course the little zipper um, this is perfect um, for even just not even at the beach if you want to just have it in your car if your toddler, toddler has a um, accident it's good to be able to put their wet clothes in here as well as as opposed to as like a little plastic bag I mean so you can get good use out of this so yes yeah, so I have that and I thought it was just so cute super cute with the little popsicles they had um I believe some dinosaurs they had some little mermaid princesses and they had like pizza which is super cute as well I might go back and get another bag of these maybe sometime next week or something but yeah so that's her beach bag I mean her wet bag and inside of her wet bag I have some baby wipes and these are the shea butter wipes and this is the equate brand that you get at walmart um plain and simple i just like to once we get out the water rather if it's at the beach even though we don't have real beaches out here they're man-made beaches and lakes and stuff like that but it's still kind of like salt water so once we get out of those or if i get out the pool with a lot of chlorine i like to wipe myself down i just don't like the feeling of it and then the smell it just oh uh, it just stinks to me so if you don't have like a wash down area some of them do but not all of them so it's good to have these and just just to have period you know you might need to just wash your hands wipe your hands really quick um if you're going to eat some places have little places where you can sit down and eat so it's good to have some wipes so of course i have these next thing i have once i get done wiping myself off now this use this up to your discretion but this is me and my preference and what i like to do this is actually johnson johnson's cologne for babies halo had this before she was born i seen this at uh babies r us and that's the only place where I've seen it, you guys. Um, hopefully, y'all can see. That's what it looks like. I found it at Baby's R Us. It smells so good. This is her own little perfume. And I just put, as y'all can see, it's not, not even halfway done. It's still a lot in here. I put this on her, especially like on Sundays and things. If we're going somewhere special, this is Halo's perfume. And I absolutely love it. So yes we have that and i like to put that on her once you get out the water because i just don't like the smell i don't anybody else like that i do not like the smell so yeah um next thing i, I have in here is the copper tone sunscreen waters baby lotion spray broad spectrum spf 50 um that's what it looks like you guys can see that there uh, I get this at I got this at Walmart um, a couple of years ago I think it was last summer as a matter of fact and I still have quite a bit in there but when you take your toddler to the water parks or just being in the sun I always try to get the highest SPF um, I get Halo 50 um, as opposed to like myself I will usually get like 35 because I can be in the sun just as much as she is but she'll get burned faster than i am just because she's a little bit more fair skinned than i am uh, so she burned faster as opposed to me so but this does work and this is water resistant up to 80 minutes so i like the spray where i can just spray it down and it's come out cool so therefore if it's really really hot it kind of cools you down as well i love it getting the sprays on her but before i put her bathing suit on i put it in my hand and i rub it on her because she don't like <laughs> she don't like for me to spray it on her because it'd be so cold but if we out in the sun for a minute then it's okay because her little body is hot so this does kind of help her cool down with the spray so if your toddler is like mine 
try to get the spray can that way if they're out in the sun or just get the lotion and the little tube or and get this however uh, but it does kind of cool their little bodies down so that's what else i have in her little bag um i have this traveling first aid kit you can find these in the travel section for a dollar i have quite a few of these i like to carry with me um in my car in my purse around the house um i used to give these to my daughters too to put in their little backpacks and when halo gets older i give her one to put in her backpack in case she need it um but you do you get like um some wipes these are hand cleansing wipes and you get like little sterile pads all purpose sponges you know sterile pads and band-aids in there which i gotta put her special band-aids because Kayla likes her character band-aids and of course i um put some neosporin in there i have quite a few of these um around the house as well in, in bags because you just never know when they're going to get a cut a scrape or anything and you need to clean it up and put something on it to protect it i love neosporin i swear by it it helps out a lot so that's what's in her little first aid kit and the next thing i have here is just a regular old brush i need to actually put another scrunchie because i need a couple of them at least um, you can also put bobby pins if you use bobby pins, but I don't use bobby pins unless I need to like hold a bun or something like that. But um, yeah, so this is just a regular old bristle brush. I have so many brushes with being with me having all girls. I could never have enough brushes in my house. So this is just an old bristle brush. Just to brush the hairs back because you know how you get out that pool, you'll be looking kind of ragged. You know that water just make your hair go everywhere. So you kind of just want to brush everything down and and look okay so yes i got that from miss halo and so that's all that's in the little wet bag um and as for like food i like to which i do have my water bottle and her little capri suns i like to freeze them and put them in the freezer that way they can be nice and cold so i do not have those with me but just to hydrate the body when it gets hot um i do like to freeze it and then i also like to have these welch's fruit snacks now i like to get the welch's ones because it does not have a lot of sugar um you get your little fruit intake it says 100 percent vitamin c 25 percent vitamin a and e fat free gluten free and it's made with real fruit and i like the little tropical ones i eat these Yes, yeah, so I have a couple of these down in the bag. So um, that's all that I have in Miss Halo beach bag. Now I'm going to share with you guys what I have in my beach bag. So this is my beach bag. And of course, it's this pink from Victoria's Secrets. I had this bag for a long time. As y'all can see, it's tearing up. I didn't even know that. But um, yeah, I had it for a long time and you get it in a free perk. So yeah. Next, first thing I have in here is my sun hat. Yeah, honey. Well, you gotta, like, flap it. Keep that sun off for you, y'all. So, I got this from, I believe it was Forever 21, some, a while back. So, yes, yeah, got my little straw hat, and it has the little band across it. And my bathing suit is black. So, and my cover up is black. So, it's perfect for that. The next thing I have in here is some Old Navy flip-flops. Uh, I would recommend you get them when they have them for a dollar. Uh, they always have a sale for a dollar. And I always try to get a bunch of them when they do have it. And that way I don't have to buy none for a while. So I haven't purchased any in about maybe three years. So these are three years old, you guys. Or maybe four. I don't know. But just some plain old white flip-flops. Next thing I have in here is, of course, my beach towel, and it is by Victoria's Secrets Pink Line. Another free perks that you get when you spend so much on your order, so I have that. I also have in here me a pair of change of clothes um, as well to change in. 
the next thing I have to share with you guys here is my um, Hawaiian tropical dark tanning oil the exotic island botanicals it says a rare blend of nature rich tanning oils I love this stuff when I'm in the Sun I want it's just sunny period and it does have UVB SPF with UVA and it has the number six so this is very very low it's gonna give you a nice tan and this will give you a beautiful tan I love it so I love to just sit out and tan myself just to be you know nice tan all over all over and it does like have like a little golden look to it um let me show you guys there I just and it smells so good so that's what it looks like but of course when you're sitting out in the sun it just gives you an even tan and i love this stuff love it next thing i got in my beach bag is this victoria's secret beauty rush lip flavor lip gloss and this one is in candy baby actually this is what i have on my lips right now um i do not wear makeup when i'm at the beach um i just don't if i do i wear maybe like a water mascara other than that i don't wear makeup so that's about all the makeup i'm going to uh, put on uh, for me just as a refresher i have my pink beach weekend which i need to buy some more because as y'all can see that's about all i have left is that much and it smells so good i love the way to smell um not even i use this all the time so that's why it's kind of low so i have that in my beach bag and then I also have this pink sugar hair perfume. This smells good. Good, 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 lady. So you know how when you um get out the water and your hair has that little funky smell to it? Just spray this down so when you're walking past people, they're like, you know. <laughs> I just like to. I know when I be walking past people at the water parks and they smell good, I'm like, you go girl you know you know how to keep it smelling good and i smell i just don't like smelling like the pool or ocean water if that makes sense that's just not me you guys um i do not have my sunglasses they are in the car so i will have them on when i go to the water park so that's the reason why they're not in here and i like to keep them in my car because if i bring them in hey look and get a hold to them and i didn't and i might leave them so that's why they're not in my beach bag so that's all that's in my beach bag i hope you guys enjoyed this video please be sure to give it a great big thumbs up if you did and if this is your first time coming across my video go ahead and click that subscribe button join the family i would truly appreciate it the more the merrier the more for me to love and with all that being said i hope you guys have a wonderful blessed but most of all safe weekend as well um be sure to be safe this weekend and get out and do something in house some fun the weather is warming up so get out the house it's gonna get wet a little bit and we're gonna go back in so i hope you do the same as well and i will see you guys in my next video